The last couple of years, we've seen a resurgence of stealth action games. We've seen Dishonored take it into steampunk. We've seen Thief take it gothic. And now we've got Styx, Master of Shadows, taking it into a fantasy setting. Um, it's got a bit of a rocky legacy behind it, I guess, this character, but it's one that we still keep an eye on, just in case. Certainly. Uh, Styx, you might have recognised from Of Orcs and Men. I don't know why you might have recognised him from that, because we gave it 5 out of 10 and recommended you definitely don't play it. Um, <laughs> slightly more hopeful that his appearance here, a much more focused uh, experience, might do quite well. Certainly it makes a bit more sense for a goblin uh, who's about half the height of a normal person being uh, better at stealth than, say, a guy dressed entirely in black, uh, you know, rather slender, looking like a version of the crow. Well, perhaps. I mean, this is looking interesting enough. I mean, Thief didn't set the world on fire when it came out earlier this year, so if you're still looking for that core stealth experience, this could offer something different and, you know, something of a refreshing setting as well. Yeah, I've got to say, actually, it's looking fairly impressive so far, so, yeah, fingers crossed we could get something quite good.